Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Friday, final two hours of the trading day. And we got quite a market, folks, to the downside. Negative action across the board right now. You're looking at an S&P negative by 44 points. You're approaching right near session lows where we've been at since about almost 1 p.m. Eastern time. For the last hour, we were also down at this level at about 1030 Eastern time. You see the range just today in the S&Ps. You're talking about 50 points, basically, from 4430, the lower end of where we're trading at right now to the higher end 44.80 at about 11.30. NASDAQ 100 pretty similar action right near the lows of the session that we made at about 10.30 14,620. Man you're talking about 230 points. We were up at 14,850 this morning. The Dow 34,412 right now you get the Russell negative by 11 at 2010. Bitcoin quite a day for Bitcoin. I got a headline ready. One trillion dollars. That is the destruction from market cap in the crypto universe right now. One trillion dollars just gone like that 38,300 you're down 4410 you're coming into Friday weekend trading in crypto a pretty big deal because of the retail aspect of things aspect of things we'll see where crypto settles over the weekend right now though 38,245 and we jump to some of those headlines there it is. Crypto crash erases more than one trillion in market values. Drop is the second largest in dollar terms. Uh, Bitcoin has declined more than 40 percent now since the November record high. And when you take a look at Bitcoin, you put this thing on a weekly. You know, next stop after 40,000 is 30,000. Clear as day on this chart. We were at 30,000 between May of last year all the way through to about July. You got a two month area that you'd have some support in Bitcoin. Jumping over to crude, back to a 15 minute, quite the acceleration for crude. You're talking about negative 56 cents, but crude holding up relatively well, considering what's happening with the market at 80, at yes, $85, we'll call it. Gold backing off a bit on this session. You're down $10 at 1832. We jumped to silver, silver shot 35 cents, and we jumped to notes and bonds. Talk about a week of volatility right now. You got the 10 year, posited by 17 ticks. We've given back some of the action that we had this morning. Yields pulling back dramatically from where we were earlier in the week. All right, folks, stay tuned. You got our man Dave White coming up live with the Power Trading Hour from 2 till 3 p.m. Eastern Time. My dad, Tom O'Brien, wraps up the trading week live from 3 till 4 Eastern. It's going to be an interesting two hours to finish the trading week, folks. Uh, you think about where we were yesterday at 3 o'clock in the S&Ps. You're talking about at 2 o'clock, we were trading at 45.68, 140 points where we're trading at right now. Stay tuned, folks.